In terms of the pros, when used correctly, this is going to be a great fat burning tool. Every single person that I have used this machine with, within the first month, they have lost anywhere from 3.3 to 8.8% body fat as assessed by a 14 site skin fold assessment. And Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in. Steven here with TV Fork, and today I've got another equipment review for you guys, and today I'm gonna to be reviewing the X-Body EMS machine. I've been using the X-Body EMS machine in my coaching practice and in my physiotherapy clinic for the last four years, and I absolutely love it. The specific model that I own is the New Wave X-Body EMS machine, and in terms of the features, it's gonna come with three different settings. There is a strength and muscle building mode to help you increase strength and improve muscle tone. There is a cardio mode, which is great for fat burning, and there's a relaxation mode, which is great for promoting blood circulation. And in terms of its uses, it's gonna be great for building building muscle, burning fat, improving endurance, and also for those of you who are unable to perform weight bearing exercises due to injury, it is a great rehabilitation tool. And now we're going to get into the pros and cons, but first, real quick, like the video and comment down in the comment section as it would really help me out and help out with the algorithm. And if you're either new to the channel or haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of the content. And now let's get into the pros and cons. In terms of the pros, when used correctly, this is going to be a great fat burning tool. Every single person that I have used this machine with, within the first month, they have lost anywhere from 3.3 to 8.8% body fat as assessed by a 14 site skin fold assessment. And as a side note, for those of you interested in learning how to perform a 14 site skin fold assessment, I'm include a link right up over here to a video I made a few years ago. Another one of the pros is that it's gonna be great for increasing strength. I remember one of my power lifters a few years ago, we ended up doing an EMS weight training session. And then the following day, we ended up doing a bench press session and he was able to hit a new PR on his bench press. The reason it's gonna be great for increasing strength is because our bodies are very, very smart. We're only gonna use what we need to use. So if you have muscle fibers that are not activating properly with the EMS machine, there's no way around it. Every single muscle fiber is going to activate because it's all being involuntarily contracted through the use of electrical stimulation. Another one of the pros is that it's a great conditioning tool. If you want to improve your endurance, this is absolutely phenomenal. And for those of you that have been following me for a while, you know that I work with a lot of professional athletes and the majority of my athletes do happen to be fighters. And the way that I love to use the EMS machine with my fighters is typically the majority of their training camp, we will do weight training and then at the tail end the last three to six weeks depending on the duration of their training camp I like to finish off with the EMS as a conditioning tool and it is absolutely terrific at helping them get ready for their fights another one of the pros is that it is going to be very very time efficient if you're just using this in a regular setting and you're not using it specifically for the purposes of conditioning then all it's going to take is 20 minutes to complete a workout and then another really great benefit is that it's a great rehabilitation tool as stated if you have a patient or if you yourself are somebody who is unable to perform and weight bearing exercises due to some type of injury, then this is going to be a great way to help you to recover in order to eventually be able to perform those weight bearing exercises. And then one of the last pros is that it requires absolutely minimal space. You can tuck it away in the corner and really all you need is a few square feet of space because you're essentially just doing body weight exercises. So you don't need much space at all. And then in terms of the cons, it is going to be quite expensive. When I ended up purchasing these four or five years ago, it was $60,000 per unit brand new. And the cost of the machines have Con gone down quite uh, quite dramatically. The new machines, if you end up getting the newer models, you can get them for under $20,000. Another one of the cons is that the model that I have, it does require you to be hooked up and plugged into the machine so it is corded, whereas the newer machines, they are cordless, so you don't actually need to be hooked up to the actual physical machine itself. And then one of the final cons is that the machines that I own, because they are a little bit outdated, they are intended for a single purse use, whereas the newer machines, you could hook up to six people on one machine and you could have six people working out at once as opposed to just having one person work working out on one machine. And in terms of who could benefit from it, if you are somebody looking to build muscle, improve endurance, increase your strength, if you want to burn some fat, this is gonna be absolutely terrific for you. If you are somebody who is unable to perform weight bearing exercises because you have some type of injury, this is gonna be terrific for you. If you are somebody who is owning, you, you own a coaching studio and you have a very limited space, it's not gonna require much space, so you will absolutely benefit from it. If you coach athletes or if you treat patients, if you are, own a physiotherapy clinic, it's gonna be great for all of those different types of people. In terms of who won't benefit from it, if you are on a budget, you're not gonna be able to get this machine because again, it is quite pricey. The newer ones, as stated, they are a little bit more cost effective. You could get them for about under $20,000 as opposed to the $60,000 on the machines that I got a few years ago. So it is a little bit more cost effective, but it is still quite pricey and you could get a lot more bang for your buck by purchasing some other types of equipment. Another person who will not benefit from it is pregnant women. If you are pregnant, you should not be using the EMS 
test machine because it could cause you to cause a miscarriage. If you are somebody that has an internal medical device, you can also not use it because it could cause the device to malfunction and you could definitely either get seriously injured or die. So you would not want to use it for that purpose. But aside from those specific individuals, it would be absolutely terrific for anybody else. And overall, I absolutely love this piece of equipment. If I had to buy it again, I would not buy the specific model that I have right now, the new wave model, just because it is a little bit outdated and you could only use one person and it requires a cord. If I were to do it all over again, I would purchase the newer model because it's cordless, it's more cost effective, it comes in a tablet version, so you don't even require that big bulky unit that I have. So overall, I would absolutely purchase the EMS machine again, only I would purchase the newer model. But that's pretty much it for today's video. If you guys have any questions at all with regard to anything that I discussed today, go ahead and ask your questions down in the comment section so I could help you guys out. And if you guys have any other reviews that you would like me to review for you, go ahead and drop your suggestions down in the comment section and just let me know what type of equipment you would want me to review for you guys. But that's pretty much it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to smash that like button so I know to keep making these types of videos in the future. And if you're either new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell as I'm going to be uploading new videos every single day. That's it for today's video. Thanks for tuning in and I will see you again tomorrow.